COVID-19 also continues to affect our local school system. The Jackson County School District experiencing a teacher and maintenance staff shortage as a result of the pandemic with over a dozen open positions. News 13's Emily McLeod spoke with school officials to find out how these shortages are impacting schools. Tony Pumphrey, the chairman of the Jackson County School Board, says seeing 13 open positions in the district is disheartening. The COVID pandemic had a toll on us. Um, a lot of your senior teachers just willing, wasn't willing to take that chance, so they retired and went home. Pumphrey says this is the highest number of teaching positions that he's seen go unfilled. Last year we had probably three, four to five positions that went on into the second nine weeks of not being filled. Not only do teacher positions need to be filled, the district's maintenance department says they're experiencing a staff shortage as well. Uh, we've had one man test positive in the last few days, and the, the men that worked around him, of course, are now being quarantined. So our typical staff of about 14 is now down to five. Stuart Wiggins, the director of facilities for the Jackson County School District, says at the beginning of the year, the department had three retirements unrelated to COVID, but the loss of three staff members put them in a hole. I told the board last night that my two electricians had spent Monday and Tuesday as plumbers. Wiggins says he is grateful his staff is talented enough to work on projects outside of their specialties while they are short-staffed. Anyone interested in applying for one of the openings can start with our website, mypanhandle.com. In Mariana, Emily McLeod, News 13, Panhandle Strong.